What is the boundary between having agency and our humble dependence on God? 스스로 행동하는 그런 힘과 겸손으로 비롯한 하나님을 의지하는 삶, 이 둘의 경계선에 대해서 말씀해 주시면 감사하겠습니다. Mm-hmm. For me, they go hand in hand. It is in many ways because of the gift of God that we can talk about agency. Like if we were not gifted with life or with power or speech from God, we could not actually do anything. So my understanding, and even something I try to cultivate in young people in churches and in ministries, um, is that anything that you are capable of doing comes from all that God has given you. And there's a way that we um, teach and empower young people not to become arrogant even in how they're operating or moving or in the agency that they operate in in the world because we teach them that this gift didn't come from you alone. Because often we're like, you didn't hatch, you didn't birth yourself, you actually had parents, but you also had some God-inspired, God-infused talents and gifts that were given to you. And it is in that that you are now capable of doing and transforming the world in these particular ways. And so that for me is how the humility of recognizing that anything and everything that I am, I owe to God, Mm -hmm. um, works with the fact that, and God strengthens me to get up every day and and pushes me and prods me and reminds me that there are other people who may not have as much. And so it's my job to kind of work on their behalf. And those are the values that we want to instill in um, young people when we talk about them cultivating agency, but being mindful of the God who is giving them the power to act. And I think it's important to recognize if agency is something like the power to act, Mm -hmm. that agency is an inherently neutral category. Mm -hmm. Um, We can use our agency to oppress, Mm -hmm. and we can use our agency to expand freedom and democracy. And so the question for me isn't so much the boundary between agency Mm -hmm. and God, um, but what kind of agency Mm -hmm. are we activating and cultivating for our young people? Mm -hmm. If we have an understanding that God wants us to be free, Mm -hmm. God wants us and all of humanity and the earth to thrive, to flourish, Mm -hmm. then when we act in in ways that promote an agency that, that gets to that end, then I think we're in the will of God. Mm-hmm. But when we're using our voices and our resources to do oppression and, and, and things that are limiting people's uh, capacity to flourish, then we can you know, rest assured that we're not in mm-hmm. the will of God. Mm-hmm. And so I think that's an important point to point out. Thank you.